Yo, what is going on YouTube? What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. How are you guys doing out there today? Today we're diving in with some Toto. Hold the line. We got the official video right here. I was asked to please check out more Toto and to check out Hold the Line. This was a song that was given to us. So let's go ahead and dive into this one. Um, I think to this point we have three Toto songs on the channel. So we're going to go ahead and take a full listen start to finish of Hold the the line right here and like I said with the music video so we'll get to see what's going on with that I did look up if there was a longer version and it looks like the longest version is 3 minutes 56 seconds this is 3 minute 58 seconds so we should get the whole song in here along with the video so gonna hit play check this one out thank you guys for hanging out today with me don't forget to like subscribe check out the description consider becoming a member three bucks is all it takes man really helps me out greatly let's go ahead dive in and uh, take a listen here we go Just keep you going on oh, the line. Love is always on time. Drum is nice. Hold the line, love isn't always on time. Be patient, it's coming, right? It's gonna show up, just keep in the game. 
Keep your heart in the game. Keep your mind in the game. Don't give up. But dude, I gotta say, I thought the music on this, fantastic. The fiery vocals, fantastic. But it wasn't to the end. I was realizing how the drumming was clipping these uh, sections together. And it's so nice. So I want to play that back and maybe we can just focus in on the drumming a little bit. Um, because dude, that drumming, I don't know what that pop is between the transitions. But it is dope. It is very enjoyable. So let's cut this back just a little bit. Pop right there. Love isn't always on time. Love is always, love is always on time. Ah. Yeah, dude, that drumming, that drumming's killing it. I love that little popping that's happening there, man. Ah, oh, especially right there, that last one. We'll play that last one a little bit more. He does a little bit more on that little part right there. Ah. just good it's just good I, I don't give enough love to drummers a lot of the time uh so just hearing that little sound in my ear uh it's, it's some popcorn happening almost man uh just popping up in there that's very nice but let's go ahead and dive in to the history on this one but this one is just fiery passionate song right here nobody is giving less than 100 percent on this thing that is for sure uh the driving key is just keeping your body swaying even in the moments of like downtime with the other instruments those keys are just always tearing it up and let's give it up to my man what is this move that he's doing right here at the beginning look i mean look at this look at this arm posture right here hitting the keys this one right here holding the manliest chin of all time up you know what i mean this move right here the ladies will fall for it every time no i'm just kidding i don't know about that but a uh, dope dope song let's go ahead and dive into this one all right, so we got Hold the Line right here from Toto, released in 1978, okay? David Pike as the songwriter on this one. Cool little artwork right here. Digging the artwork reminds me a little bit of some 80s TV shows that I didn't grow up with, but I got to see later on in my life. Uh, Hold the Line is a song by the American rock band Toto from their 1978 uh, debut studio album, okay? Written by Key, uh, the band's keyboard is David Pike. The lead vocals on the song were performed by Bobby Kimball. Bobby Kimball looks so much like that actor. Um, David P Pascal, maybe is his name. They look so much alike. When I see Bobby uh, singing, I cannot help but think of... Uh, Mr. Pascal as well. I think that's his name. I think that's his name. He was on a TV show recently that we watched some of it uh, at a few episodes of it with my daughter it was based off a video game and i cannot remember it but it's like um a fungus kind of taking over people um anyway jeff picario the band's drummer gave a definition for the song hold the line was a perfect example of what people would describe as your heavy metal chord guitar licks your great triplet a notes on the piano your sly hot fun in the summertime groove all mishmashed together with uh, a boy from new orleans singing and it really crossed over a lot of lines this song is fun it's undeniable banger of a song so shout out to that uh definitely a great one it says german version taking it back i don't know what that is alternate cover oh so just the cover this is the cover that was released in most places this was the german cover i guess i don't know why uh maybe swords weren't allowed i i, I don't know uh what the deal behind that one background on this one it says keyboard is david pike noted that the song was relatively easy to develop he began with the piano riff uh which would become the song's intro and chorus that riff is amazing on the piano after toying with the piano riff one night he stayed he started singing hold the line love isn't always on time and found the lyric to be suitable fit the verses were subsequently finished two hours later that's crazy that's so cool I, I like this too because growing up um liking writing lyrics i didn't know how you could write a song and i still don't know today how many people created music but giving some of these uh wiki backgrounds i'm able to develop how some songs are written so you see right there they started with the keys then he found a hook and then they built everything else after the keys and the hook so that's cool to know. That's really cool to know. So uh, I didn't always know if there's like a set uh, progressive pattern that you use to make songs. I know in some 
cases like Red Hot Chili Peppers, it simply their song simply comes sometimes from the guitarist and the singer just hanging out together, and he'll play something on guitar, and uh, Homeboy will find something to sing, Anthony Kiedis will find something to sing with it, and then boom, you've got a, the workings of a song starting, right? Um, so I don't know, very fun to always see. I think that's amazing. These guys killed this. They did absolutely fantastic on this. So I hope you guys enjoyed rocking out with me. Thank you. Let me know more from Toto that you guys want to see featured on the channel. Greatly appreciate that. Don't forget to like, subscribe, check out the description. Consider becoming a member of my YouTube Patreon. Three bucks is all it takes. Thanks, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.